All right. <laughs> There's, uh, again, I don't know if this is, uh, there's any way to place yourself here without a map I'm at the bottom of the new pasture we're cleaning maybe you remember in other videos I've showed you this creek in which now all the water is headed into my pastures because we're at the beginning of a drought here in Spain so for no better reason than it's Near the entrance, I've been clearing this with the despertadora or weed whacker, as we say in English, and opening it up. That's really it. Just opening it up. Here I went a little, I was uh, aggressive and crushed all the leaves with the blade that's on, apparently, uh, that is presently attached to the machine. It's a clearer, here's the now dry creek, because, as I said, the water's um, going to the pasture up there. So, lots of work still to do. It's a bit overwhelming when we get inside and you see something like this, and know there's like six of these that need to be cleared and deciding which trees can stay. I'd like all of them to stay, but that's impractical and silly. So which ones? These form a fence. So by the very nature of location, these, I don't know what they are. Maybe ohm trees, I don't know. They will stay because they save me money on and time putting a fence here. So what I'm doing is taking the debris there, the dead escobas, these which need to be cut, and using them to heighten the fence. Just put them between the stone and the oak trees that serve as a fence on the other side of the stone wall. Here, it opens up. Elaine and I have cut a number of Escobas, most of them have been moved out of the way, but these dead ones I need to uproot and use as fence. So, before I sign off, let's take a walk over here. My machine. What a great place to live when you can leave your expensive machinery out overnight, not carry it back home and bring it back. So, the first section of fence is up, and it may be the only section I need. Don't know. The boys can come in. They're not going to hop this fence while it's too short. The drop off on the other side is enough to uh, detour them. Plus, again, these oak trees serve as fence. So it's up. Ah. There are things I need to do to, it's just up. It's not finished. I'll finish it when it needs to be finished, when there's nothing else to do. It's up, it's not going anywhere, but it's certainly not finished. I have to tie things down. There are only uh, wires wrapped. One here, one here occasionally on the bottom, very few on the bottom to tighten it down. There needs to be maybe four per four meters, not two, and the bottom needs secured. All right, that's the update for today, end of April. I'm gonna start up the machine and whack away at stuff. Okay, till next time.